Okay, I didn't like my mouth breathing in that last video. So I'll scale back the reception a bit on my microphone this time. So we'll see what it's like on this particular occasion. Overall, though, this microphone is a lot better than, than my um, laptop microphone, I think. My voice doesn't quite sound silky smooth, but um, if not even a million dollars would make me sound like a superstar, I don't think. I this is a up to a to a promising star. In fact, when I was watching this, I think this person's name seems familiar like a play done before. I mean, he used to have pictures up there at sea. And um, when I looked at the past recordings, um, I, r I recognised his picture before, and, and I had to go with the name, and even though he doesn't have a picture this time, I am wondering if it's the same person, considering we're at near enough the same rank, I think, as the last times I played him. the rail bass played him but then again I think the first times I played him in these recordings I beat him most of the time so maybe we're pretty much equal really in terms of skill even though he's looked a lot better for most of the for, for this session most of this session really well yeah I thought we got a win there It's funny, that's the funny thing about Tetris, sometimes certain sometimes certain players can have good days and win and win a lot against against certain people and then other days other players will have good days and win against you a lot. I mean, unless the lag is just like a contagious disease, sometimes you've got it and sometimes the other person has it instead. It makes me think how sometimes I've thought of lag as being like an, an offensive body, body order. When you play uh, multiplayer online games, uh, people complain about it a lot and you're thinking, no, that can't be me, it must be someone else. And then you look around and everyone's looking at you and suddenly you realise, oh, it must be me. And so then you don't want to show your face ever again. Talk about the story of my life. To be honest, I think the thing that made me smell badly a lot in life is the fact that I was always prone to put on a lot of body fat, even though I've got a skinny frame. And so it meant that I soon started sweating and smelling bad. Add to that the fact that I always walked to school every morning while all the rich kids probably show probably went to school in their dad's Toyotas or Ferraris or whatever. Still not that I care, materialism isn't everything in the world. It just feels like it. No, it doesn't. Morality is everything in the world. Morality, dignity, integrity and all those are lovely things. Uh, that was almost close. Except she had two more knockouts than me. 
but buddy line sends were close at least. But yeah, this has ended up being another terrible session for me. So far I've only won one out of six games. Not even the San Jose Sharks had that bad of a season the first time, the first year that they, the first, the first year that they played in the, in the National Hockey League. In fact, the, when you think about it, the only. The only highlight of San Jose's first year in the National Hockey League was a man called Link Gates, a fighter, an enforcer. Every time, every time the Sharks would be losing a game, he would pick a fight with another player in order to, in order to get his team back into the game, in order to get his team. In order to get his team back in the game mentally, and because the Sharks lost a lot, that meant he ended up fighting a lot. And he racked up something like over 300 penalty minutes in just 50 games, which is just over half a season. So it makes you imagine how many penalty minutes he would have racked up if he played the full 84, 82 games, doesn't it? Especially when you think they're a the world re the NHL record for most penalty minutes in a season is something like maybe 430 or something set by uh, David Schultz, who's one of the most famous NHL tough men of all time. Even Bob Probert only managed 398 penalty minutes during his most penalised year. single person version of sometimes I feel like I'm Tetris's version of what the San Jose Sharks were during their first year in the National Hockey League. Yeah, some, yeah I do sometimes I feel that way. Anyway it seems like this is over this seems like this particular session is over, so I'll just check to see that I've got no more power ups or battery or battery power or battery power, which I haven't. So see you later. Goodbye.